Welcome back, everybody, to what will probably be the final episode on this map. And I think I might have started out last episode with that same intro, but this one is for real. So let's get started. We've got actually quite a bit to do for the last episode to wrap up this map. We are going to be selling off basically everything. Uh, let's just start by selling off the cows. How about that? And then we actually have a lot of silage over there that I didn't even think about until just now. But we can take that to the BGA. So that'll be top defense. That'll be great. Hopefully we'll be able to make some money there. But for now, selling the cows. All right. We have livestock sold, which brings us to... So we started with 35... Well, no. Okay, so... Uh, 6980. I'm just trying to record all this. Well, it doesn't really matter. 63,000. 63,800. Oh, so this is my spreadsheet that I'll be using for each year. You know, I have year one. Here, you know what? Let's uh, maybe, maybe be good to zoom in a little bit. All right, so this is my spreadsheet that I came up with for, uh, you know, you get all the expense categories there. I would do it a little bit differently if, if it was... Uh, if it was just me, but then, you know, this is how it's set up in games, right? It's basically copied those and then I have it set up for the seasons and each, I think we're going to do nine day seasons. So, uh, the history tracks for four or five days with expenses. So as long as I do it once per season, we'll be able to keep record of this and then our annual expenses will be over there. And then down here, I will, whoops, this needs to go over one. Uh, because the one on the left is the field. So this will be where we track the input cost for each field with the seed. You know, this will be the volume and then the cost fertilizer volume and then cost and then yield. And then I'll probably record maybe the price I sold it at and that value. So that way we can track our input cost versus our, uh, you know, the profit that we get from the, from the land. Let's see what's next. What did I say was next? Oh, there's no more mooing. Goodbye, cows. All right, so we need to sell some of this stuff off. We're going to have a lot of trips over to the store. I will probably skip some of them just because it would get really monotonous, I think, uh, going over there. If uh, if I sound if I sound uh, hoarse at all, it's because I just woke up from the night shift. I took a sleeping pill to help me sleep really well. And I'm kind of really tired from that still. So still trying to get woke, woken, waked up, wait. I don't know. I don't know which was the proper way. Anyway, uh, let's, uh, should we sell this while we're here? Let's open that silo up. So we have 50,000. You know, that's a, that's a decent amount. I'm thinking that might actually... It actually might get us a decent profit over at the... Wait, is there even a VGA? Okay, so let's go over to prices. Where's silage? That's the one that looks like a circle, right? Yeah, silage. So we have silage at the Methajoule. Where is the Methajoule? <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little out of it. Okay, so that is... Where is that? That's a sell point? Wait, that's the... Oh, that's not the pigs. That's that's the city right before the pigs, right? That's a, that's a place? Okay. <laughs> Where is Fritz at? Fritz is at... Oh, that's right, because we just finished up the corn. So Fritz, we're going to have to go get Fritz. And then we'll start... Maybe we, maybe we should sell the silage first. And then we'll come back and take care of selling all of these. So let's let's go get Fritz first, and I'll meet you. No, maybe we'll sell some stuff first. Yeah, basically the way this episode is going to go is we're going to sell off everything, and then we will. Wait, I thought Fritz was there. Wrong way. <laughs> okay. Um. I'll just probably cut through this and I'll meet you over at Fritz. Let's hop on in here. And this was from that field that we finished. We just never 
we never sold this grain. So let's go sell this grain. And we'll hop back inside Fritzy. There we go. All right, we'll turn on our flashers. And I think we're good to make a wide turn there, miss the rock, and off we go. All right. So, selling stuff. Yeah, whoa, that's a, that's a pretty big drop off there. Yeah, I think, like I said, I will, I think I'll skip, yeah, I'll probably just cut that out. I don't think that'd make for a very interesting time lapse, just uh, transferring stuff to the store and uh, back. So I think I'll probably skip that, but let's see how we're going to do this. We can buy a front loader, or not a front loader, the, uh, whatever that transport trailer is, but I'm thinking that we will, yeah, that'll be part of the rental cost. So let's, we'll get our total first and then we'll buy the trailer and maybe a semi or whatever, but we'll, we'll ride off into the sunset with Fritz and Bessie at the very end of this episode, but first thing we have to do is sell everything first so all right here we are pulling back into the farm with fritz turning off the flashers i think that oh yeah that was one thing we never decided if we were going to take evelyn with us or not i would really love to have evelyn but eh, you know since we i think we're going to start with the with another smaller tractor we don't really need evelyn so i think we'll probably miss miss evelyn all right, I think if I just pull forward a little bit more and back up, should be basically at a right angle. And we'll turn it off there. Yeah, that's, that's good enough. All right, so I can load that up later. I think I want to take Bessie and the head. Yeah, we'll just load up everything from the store. I think that'll be easier. So instead of bringing the loading trailer over to here. I think we'll just take everything to the store. So we'll sell the heads and we'll just buy new headers when we get over to the west coast. I think... Come on. There we go. Alright. Let's hook that up. And off we go. Like I said, I think I will skip most of the footage of just going back and forth to the store, so I'll catch you over there. All right, here we are pulling into the store. We'll drop off the corn head first, and then we will back in for the other one for the trailer. And... Let's see, I just had a thought on the way over here, but I forget <laughs> completely what it was. So, attach PTO. There we go. Uh, what was that thought? Uh, it was somewhat significant. I forget what it was, though. I can't remember. Oh, well, I guess it wasn't that important. If it was, it'll come back up. So, let's, uh, let's try to, yeah around here and get rid of this header unfortunately I just don't think it's economical to take the header with us it would cost us what did we say like 5,000 to transport smaller things instead of uh, vehicles yeah that's right I said 10,000 per vehicle and 5,000 for everything else but I don't know based on the size and the space of that header I mean that might cost as much to ship as something larger like Fritz for example just because I know they I know they value space when you ship things as well as size and weight space well space is the same as size you know what I mean okay so let's sell the header and now we gotta exit the bubble and go all right so we got us a little bit from there Let's get, let's get Bessie out of the way. We'll move Bessie over here. 
And, oh, so this reminds me, I think I do have some wool. I never sold wool from back when I had sheep at the beginning of this farm. So we'll have to go over there and collect those wool pallets and sell them. That'll give us a little something. Um, so, yeah, everything else is, right? Or no, we do have one thing over there. Okay, so we have one thing at the ETA. Everything else is over there at home. All right. Now we get to run back home. <laughs> all right. Oh, you know what? Let's uh, let's finish up all this other stuff first, then we'll do silage at the very end. How about that? Okay, so we're going to hook into... Yeah, we'll just take all those home. We do remember that we need to save these for the wool that we want to pick up. We can sell the bale fork, but the... The pallet forks, where are they at? Those are for the JCB. Uh, I don't know if I have pallet forks. But anyway, let's get to selling things. All right, welcome back. We have just finished selling almost every vehicle. Uh, we still have to scoop out the silage. I'll probably show that on camera. But I am bringing the, not vehicle, I meant tools, implements. I'm bringing the trailer over here to the sheep. I'm not sure how many bales of wool that we have but if there's more than one i didn't want to have to take more than one trip and since we are selling this guy anyway i think that whoops not that way this is the way to the sheep i think that it will be a good idea to bring this just in case so that way we don't have to make more than one trip if i remember correctly the wool is in here oh boy this is actually gonna be a oh oh wow three Three basically full pallets. All right. Well, that's actually more than I expected. But hey, that's that's a good thing. All right, let's back up here and maybe should I unhook there. A little bit further. That's we'll call that good enough. Um, now where do you sell the wool at? Wool is what does wool look like <laughs> on the PDA? Okay, right there. So it's at the Vente de Lane. Vente de Lane. Is that at the shop? I think that's at the shop. Okay. So let's get let's get to it. Well, this is going to be interesting. Um, certainly. Oh, boy. So do we... I guess, yeah, okay. I, I didn't think I was going to be able to make that turn. It's kind of tight in here, but I guess we did. Okay, just fine. Can I get two of them? Do the forks go through? No, just one. Okay. Oh, well. All right, this one is all the way full. We'll put this one on the, well, maybe we should put them all on the back. So that we want to go to sell them. I can just back the trailer in. Okay, fine. Stupid wall. We'll just put them wherever. All right, so this will make a tidy little profit, hopefully. And oh my goodness, it's just, it is pretty tight in here. It's, I have to make a wider turn. This would have been a much better job for Evelyn. Evelyn can make these tight turns. All right, so this one is the almost full one, 1718. Oh, look at how easy that slides off there when you use pallet forks. So much better than using a bale spike for this and getting stuck like when I <laughs> had the trailer full of seed and fertilizer. That was not a fun experience. Okay, come on. There we go. Stab it enough times, you'll eventually get it right. Probably not the best philosophy. <laughs> Sounds more like an assassin's philosophy. Philosophy. Stab it enough times and you'll eventually hit the vital organs. <laughs> it's okay. We are having way too much fun. I think it's it's fun because I see the money, right? It's money. Selling stuff. Get some money. This is the fun part. 
All right. Let's get out of here. Oops. Should we do this? Yeah, we don't want to... We don't want any of those to fall off. So, there we go. Let's ratchet them down. Even though it's a short trip, it is a bumpy one. So, this will make it a little bit safer. It certainly would not be fun to watch one of those fall into the water. <laughs> Hell, as we almost drive into the water. All right, let's get over to the store and sell these off. And so, is that right here? Hold on, let's take a let's take a look at the map. All right, we have. You know what? Let's just where is it? Let's just uh, let's just tag the place, right? It is called Ven. No. Then heard a lane. A lane, I think, is the wool, right? Yeah, that's the wool. The other one is where we sell bales and where's the silage? The silage is all the way at the top one. Okay, so this place is where is it at? It's flashing. Okay, so it is not the store. It is somewhere in town. Oh goodness. Not this again. <laughs> oh man. So where are we going to sell the wool at? Hopefully, it's not as hard to get to as the milk originally was. Let's go figure it out. Somewhere. Oh, is it over there somewhere? Hold on. Well, let's get out and look. Nice little farmer's market. It is. Yeah, it's not here. It's up the hill. Well, at least it'll be a little easier with this trailer because we don't have to worry about being way too heavy. Although, we may have to worry about being way too long. This is not the most fun drive to take. Yeah, I'm already stuck on something. Stupid flower boxes. Are you kidding? How? Okay, I gotta drive on the sidewalk to goodness oh goodness okay sorry I'm gonna run you over people yeah there it is there's the sell point so I think we'll be able to turn around up here and get out of here but that was that was fun not necessarily Okay, let's pack in here and sell the wool. Get out of there. Why? Sell. Sell. Okay, so we get to do this the realistic way, I guess. And unload them for real. Alright, we actually made a... That's actually... Nice little profit for the wool. Wool just might be one of the more profitable things in this game. Whoops. In the more realistic mod, at least. As long as you don't damage the wool. <laughs> okay. We're just gonna... Let's just push it in there. There we go. There we go. That's a little easier. That is some nice money. That's some pretty good money. All right, let's uh, drop that off and make the same. No, drop, stop it. Stop, just stay. There. <laughs> Stupid thing. Stupid operator more correctly. All right, we got, that's some pretty good uh, wool prices. Let's hook back up here. And let's get out of here. Oh goodness, this is the fun part. Where? Do we? Oh man, there's just okay. We gotta go around the tree to turn around. This is a nightmare. It's a little bit too tight to take otherwise. Okay, there we go, and let's try to make it out of here without killing anybody or 
running into anything, which I think is going to be a pretty tall task, but let's try it. We can do it. Okay, so we'll miss that guy. Someone just say hi. And we'll try to take that turn wide, and then we'll get to the left, and did we do it, guys? We did it! We did it! No! No! No, I'm so close! What did I hit? The road? What did I hit? I'm stuck on the sign. I think I was stuck on the sign back there. Oh, goodness. We were, I spoke too soon. And <laughs> we almost made it without hitting something. Worst driver in the world. Okay. Let's sell this stuff off and get back home. We've got just the silage left to sell. And I think we'll double check when we get home there. Actually, let's uh, move in a little bit more and drop that and now back away. There we go. So let's, uh, I guess we should sell that first. Sell and sell. All right. Sell our bale trailer. I had to buy a new shovel. Oh no, the silage. I had to buy a new shovel because I accidentally, <laughs> I accidentally sold the shovel when I forgot that we were using it for silage. Uh, you know, I didn't, I didn't drive all the all the front loader implements tools to the store. I just sold them outright. You know, I, you know, what's fifty percent of a thousand? Five hundred? I. Yeah, so I, I didn't take the time to drive every single one of those to the store. I thought that would be a little ridiculous. So I had to... Oh, man. You know what? Here's what we're going to do. We're going to... Let's go to the garage. We're just going to sell that. I'll drive Evelyn to the store because that is a good amount of money. We'll sell the pressure washer. Uh, okay, so before we sell this, let's do this now. So let's get in the vehicle so it's a little bit quieter. And oh, we can't do it inside the vehicle. Okay, so you know what? Let's just drive home and then we'll do that because that's really loud. Oh, so, okay. All right, so we're back at home and I never, I never finished my thought. What we're going to do is... Since I accidentally sold off everything, we're just going to say that the farmer who is buying the farm, he is going to start a dairy. And so he is more than happy to pay for the silage. And he also wants the hay that is left up here. He is more than happy to pay for all of that. So let's get out and start counting, shall we? We will count all this up. So we'll give him that one for free. So uh, that's 4000 one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we have nine bales of hay. So let's look at these prices. Are these per liter? Maybe we should just give them hay for free. I don't know what these are. Where are the bales? Oh, zero for, zero for bales, really? I thought that you could sell bales with the season mod. Or the more realistic, more... Okay, well, I guess they're free. So we'll give... He's getting all the bales for free. Now we just have to calculate the silage. So that is 216 per 1,000 liters. So let's add up how many thousand liters we have. We have... Right there, 63888 plus... Let's head on over the wall if I can do it one-handed because I'm holding the calculator in the other hand. And 50, we'll just call it 50,000. You know what? We should probably call both of them 50,000. So let's just say it's 100,000 because you probably wouldn't be able to tell exactly how much silage there is in here. So we'll just call 100,000, but we're, we said we're selling it to him for 50% off because it's good for us and good for him. So... 50,000, so what would that be? That'd be 50 times 216. 
is ten eight. So ten thousand dollars. So we add three five one eight zero. Hold on. We've got ten thousand. You know what? This will just we'll just add this over here. So ten thousand for the silage. And uh we'll say we'll say five thousand for the bales. Because they are valuable to him. So um then we want to get the fields. So let's just F I E L D S. Okay, so let's head back into our app control Z, not Alt Z. <laughs> okay, so we are adding them up. So what's the lowest number? Four on there, I think. So let's head to field four. The cost is 63137 plus field five, right? We own, oh no, we also own two. That's right. Two, three, four, five. So we own two, which is one, zero, six, seven, two, eight plus. Um, I think that I... I came up with 10 billion. I think I might have included a zero in there at some point. So, you know what? I can calculate these up later and I'll add them to the spreadsheet. So, for now, though, I think that just about does it. We just have to drive this trailer back to the store, sell Evelyn, and drive off into the sunset. So, I think that we will do, you know, I'll sell that off screen, but we'll. We'll probably include driving off into the sunset at the beginning of the West Coast series, kind of to signify the move. And so that should be all for this map. Let's uh, get a good look at, I don't know. Let's, uh, let's fade off into the distance, looking over through the fields. And anyway, this has been a fun map. I encourage you all to check it out and play it. And yeah, until next time. Thanks, guys. Bye.